Loading layouts using Elementor is super easy and it should take you no more than a couple of minutes. Here we have an awesome and professional looking coach layout for your website. And if you like this one, let me show you how you can install it on your website and how you can customize it. First thing you want to make sure to do is to create a new page where you would like your coach template loaded. Click on the title or the edit button below the title to edit the page. Then click edit with Elementor. This will open Elementor page builder. And here perhaps the first thing you would like to do is to go to settings and change page layout. I want to get rid of this default header and the footer. So what I want to choose is Elementor canvas. And as you can see, uh, this left me with only a blank page without the header and the footer. To add our layout, uh, we need to do two things. First, we want to insert our template into the library. And second thing, we want to add CSS code for it. So let's start with the first one. Click add template. And this will open Elementor library. Here by default, a pages tab is open and you can find a number of uh, built-in page layouts you can choose here. Also, there are some individual blocks or sections which you can uh, choose to compose a page. And there's my templates tab and all the templates, all the layouts that you import on your own are going to be listed here. Since we don't have any yet, we want to upload a new one. Click this arrow upload button here uh, and then click select file. Navigate to files you downloaded and what you want to select here is coach elementor template import json file. So it's a json file. Select it and click open. And in a moment you'll see that this template is imported into the library and that you can find it under my templates. Next thing you want to do is to click insert button. Click it and our coach template is going to be uh, laid out on the page. Very nice. Now, next thing we want to do, as we said earlier, is we also want to add CSS code. At the moment, you can see that template looks pretty much good, but it's not as the same as on the demo page we've seen earlier. Uh, there are some small things that can be uh, can look better and CSS is responsible for that. So let's update and save this page and then let's add the CSS. To add the CSS, uh, navigate back to files you downloaded. And next to JSON file we used earlier, you're going to see Coach Elementor template CSS file. And you want to open this file with a text editing program. I use Notepad++, it's a free and a great one and I recommend it, but you can open this file with any other text editing software. Select and copy everything from here and you want to paste this CSS on your website and you want to do that in your theme options. I'm using 2017 theme for this example, so I want to go to appearance then customize. And here I want to toggle additional CSS box and paste the CSS here. Now let's hit publish and let's make sure that our page looks uh, good. Let's see, everything looks pretty much good, that's it. Now let me also show you how you can customize this page, how you can for example update the images, change the text color and size and more. Let's click edit with Elementor, so this will open Elementor page builder once again. Let's start with the first section here and let's update this background image. For that you want to hover over this section and then click edit section icon or button. Then go to style tab and here you want to click on the image and replace it with a new one. Select any image from your library and click insert media. And in a moment you will see that uh, image has already been changed on the website so you can already know how it is going to look like. And to update the text, again, you want to click on it and go to style tab or if you want you, or if you would like to change the content of the text, you can do it in the content tab, let's say our new text and to update how it is going to look like on your website, go to style tab and here you can change text color, 
uh, if you click this pencil icon next to typography it will open some more text options you can change the size here letter spacing font family and something else let's scroll down uh, to update this again once again just click on it click on the image to change it or click on the text uh, scrolling down these elements here once again you want to click on it and you can change the image the content pretty much same as what you already uh, saw perhaps that's it for this tutorial uh, nothing else to say here so all you have to do is to click on an element navigate through content style and advanced tab in advanced tab you have uh, some spacing options and you can assign your element unique ID or class name uh, and some more options so that's it for this tutorial I hope you like Elementor our uh, coach template and thanks for watching